we're down 12 basis points at the front end on a two-year 487. Rick on a 10-year, we're down 12 to 454. It's only a few Mondays ago. We had a five handle on a 10-year. We're now back to about 450 on a 10-year. Rick, it's not amazing. It's not fantastic. It's not terrible either. It's not brutal. What is it? Uh, so, so I'd say a couple of things. I agree with everything Mohammed said around the uh, around the numbers. You know, the one thing, a couple of other points I would make relative to that. One is, you know, it's interesting. You know, we've talked about it on the show before. If you look at if you look at things like healthcare and education, another eighty-nine thousand jobs positive. There's only one hundred and fifty total. You take that out, and then take out leisure and hospitality, which have been strong. The cyclical components uh, continue to moderate down. I think that's a really big deal. Um, and then, you know, the other side of it is, you know, if you take all the economic data we've gotten, it's all indicative of an economy that's slowing moderately, very moderately, but slow. Slowing. But the labor data has been solid. I mean, look at the JOLTS report this week. Claims is still solid. The ECI is still solid. Now you're starting to see there is a lag dynamic. Now you're starting to see that for the Fed. It's a really big deal now that you're starting to see labor be symmetric to what you're seeing in other parts of the, econo of the economy and the economic data. Listen, I think the Fed's done. I mean, I, you know, I think that's it. I mean, we needed to see the pay, you know, everything else is moderating. And by the way, you look at the manufacturing data. It, including the earnings reports we got almost across the board. And then obviously you look at it to the extent that, which the Fed should look at the global conditions, Europe is really slowing. So I think you should assume at this point the Fed is done. By the way, month on month, we were looking at average hourly earnings and aggregate hours. And so you had flat income growth. I mean, that's, you know, for the Fed, I think that's a big deal that, that it corroborates. Inflation is coming down, not straight line. Payroll is starting, labor now is finally starting to come off a bit. So I think it's a big deal, and I, I think at this point that the Fed is going to be on hold for a while, and it probably could take December out of your, out of your calculation.